Brittany here at Miss Glamour Girl 1992. Welcome to my channel. Live once again in my room, as promised. I'm going to do a video on this hair. It is a wig that I made using um, Bobby Boss Indie Remy Ocean Wave hair in 16 inches and 12 inches. Um, this is the box that it comes in. Uh, Ocean Wave. This is a 12 inch box. And. What I did was, I actually purchased a sports cap, a men's nylon sports cap, and I sewed the hair onto the cap using my foam head, which I custom made to fit my head. And what I did was, I just put foam on my, not foam, I put foil on my head, and then I duct taped it, then I took it off and put it on here, stuffed it, and duct taped it around this head. So it would be the perfect fit for my head because this thing is small these things are small so you don't want to make it on a foam head that isn't your exact shape well you, isn't your exact size because if you do then the cap is not going to be the right fit for your head unfortunately that is how I made the cap just use a regular curved needle thread the whole nine and yeah the method I used for the part was actually a method that I saw um, Mimi Mimi Janielle. Janelle. The method I used for the part is actually a method that I saw Mimi Janielle use. Jan, uh, Janielle use. So this will probably go as a, um, a video response to her video, but that's what I. That's the way I saw her do her part um, as a closure and stuff. But this is what I made. It is straightened out. And I do have layers cut into it. I'm still working on the layers for the back because I feel like the back is just really, really big. And I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't like the back that much because it's just straight and it's so big. Like it's really, really voluminous and stuff. So I don't know. I'm still working on the cut. It's not perfect yet. But yeah, this is my favorite side though. I like how this looks. <laughs> But I just put some curls in it using my um, Leonardo Turbo Silk Fat Flat Iron, which is somewhere around here. But I did straighten it out completely. So this is the length of it. And then in the back, it is 16 inches. So yeah, it's pretty long. Um, I like it. <laughs> but that is the update for the hair. It is a wig. I'm doing this video now because I'll probably take it off. It's really, really hot, and I live in Florida, so I'm going to be bunning my natural hair the way I've been doing it um, in recent videos. So, yeah. Anyway, I just wanted to update you guys on the, on the hair video because I'm sure I'll probably get questions about it, but it is the Bobby Boss Indie Remy Ocean Wave Hair, 16 inches, 12 inches, and it's on a nylon men's sports cap sewn on there. So... Yeah, I also have two clips, one clip here and one clip here, just to keep it secure. The back is perfectly fine, um, mostly because I put a track on the interior from like here. I put a track on the interior perimeter, and with it being spandex or with it being stretchy, the track kind of holds it in place, which is really, really good. But I do still have clips here. I'm not actually using the clips right now, but... Um, I guess just for extra security if I need to use them I sold them on the inside but this is the hair I really like it um, the only thing that I, I do notice about this hair is if you cut the wefts actually I don't know how it is if you don't cut the wefts but if you cut the wefts the wefts it will shed like a sick dog just so you guys know that um, but otherwise the hair looks great I actually for some reason I had the hair just in a little like storage container for some reason and I didn't have it straightened out I didn't have it organized let me just put it like that it was kind of just like took it off my head I think I was frustrated I just took it off my head threw it in the container it's been sitting there for the past couple months all I did was pulled it out combed it out combed out perfectly combed out fine um, combed it out and put it on a wig cap. I knew I had washed it when, before I put it in the container, so I didn't even wash it. And this is what it looks like. It's been in there for months, and this is what it looks like, you guys. The hair is bad. I'm not going to lie. The hair is bad, but it does shed. That's the only problem. 
so yeah I really like it um, I, I'm the type of person I need to change my look all the time I get bored easily I've actually been bunning my hair for the past month and a half so the videos with the buns in them I've been doing that for about a month and a half now as you can see I could I did change up the buns a lot like I did the bun with the Marley hair I did the regular bun and then I am doing like this mini bun um, I'll, put, I'll put a picture of the buns at the end of the video but that's the styles I've been wearing recently so I definitely like this for a change um, but as as you can see it is a wig I can take it off put it on I'm taking it off right after this video just so y'all know but I really like to change up my style so for those who um, subscribe to my video off my natural hair videos just know I am natural I do wear my hair out quite a bit but I do change my style a lot so if I come out with a wig or if I come out with some crochet braids or something that is perfectly normal for me just so you, you guys know that um, but anyway yeah I just wanted to show you guys this and I hope you like the hair um, the hair packs the packs were hmm, I want to say the packs were like $70 each believe it or not and I bought these last year so I don't know how the pricing is right now but last year they were not, actually hold on $72 the pack tag is still on it was $72.99 um, so this was last year about this time around this time yeah May early May is when I bought the hair so I don't know how much you can get them for now but I do like it don't cut your webs or seal your webs if you cut them because it will shed like a sick dog but I do notice that even if it does shed it's still really full like I'm like I said I am wanting to get this cut I'm wanting this back to get sheared out so yeah as far as tangling it does tangle it does not mat which is amazing like I said I pulled this out of like a giant hairball of a, a mess in my container and it took me like five minutes to get all of it these are two full packs it took me like five minutes to get it all perfectly fine on my little hangers and that was it so and it's been in there for months so just know that this hair will not mat it can tangle but it will not mat on you but anyway i hope you guys like it and i will talk to you guys in the next video